Good morning, I'm John Perkins at the Opening Market Minute. Grains and oil seeds are higher so far on Friday morning with soybeans in the lead. Despite the lack of any real public progress in trade negotiations with China this week, apparently a lot of progress was made and China has agreed to buy 5 million tons of U.S. soybeans as basically a good faith measure. Negotiations are expected to resume within the next few days. Corn's following the lead of soybeans at this point, and they're both keeping an eye on weather conditions in parts of Brazil. And as for wheat, up modestly following corn and soybeans at least so far, waiting to see if there's any winter kill in parts of the plains and Midwest, and watching the pace of exports out of the Black Sea region. Live and feeder cattle are mixed, still getting ready for this week's widespread direct cash cattle business. Outside of some light trade yesterday in Iowa, the major feeding areas have been pretty quiet. And hogs are mixed so far on demand uncertainties. Pork was not brought up in this latest round of trade negotiations with China, at least not publicly. And despite the continued concerns about the impact of African swine fever on their herd, a lot of Chinese consumers have turned to poultry instead of trying to find more pork. I'm John Perkins with the Opening Market Minute.